Hey, it's Aldi from the Mind Body Project. I just want to talk about something that's because um, I've got a challenge in my life which is coming up, and I'm gonna record this all on and sort of display it for everybody to see. So, what well, the challenge is, I'm gonna have an operation on my shoulder, my left shoulder. Um, I've torn rotator cuff, and so I'm gonna have my arm in a sling for period around about six weeks and then it's going to be about two months training and physio to get back to um, back to normal back to my uh, normal self so what I'm gonna do though is I'm gonna I keep saying about the this hypnosis and on all this so I'm gonna actually video me um, with my progress throughout this and what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually use some of the techniques to actually heal um, it cause accelerated healing in my body um, so I'm going to do this every day I'm going to do the um, hypnosis um, a thing called a healer within technique um, on the master practitioner course and then I'm going to use a few other hypnotic tools to actually get my body to actually heal quicker than what it would normally take so that's um, something that people are very interested. I've spoke to people about this, and they're very interested in um, seeing what happens from this because your unconscious mind, you can get it to actually heal a lot quicker. Um, we had a case for on our master practitioner course where um, one of the guy's sons actually broke his leg, and it healed in nine days because of some techniques that were used. Now this isn't typical, uh, but that's that's what happened in that case, which shocked the doctors there, and that's got me thinking that, again. My mindset is that I'm being put in a position now where there's a challenge coming up, and it's like, how do I take advantage of this challenge or this set of circumstances that I'm now going to be put in? And this is the way that I think I'm going to do it. So I'm going to use the techniques I'm going to use are so I'm going to use a thing called quantum touch quantum touch technique, quantum field healing, hypnosis, and some NLP um, healer within techniques. So I'm gonna use all of those techniques to see and really sort of use those every day to actually um, help me accelerate and recover a lot quicker. And I'm also gonna use the hypnosis for a lot of the pain control because you can actually control pain and switch it off and switch it on um, through hypnosis which they've done with dentists. Um, some dentists have actually used hypnosis on patients and they've, um, they've not used any uh, painkiller at all uh, because some, some of them were, some people are allergic to the painkiller. And what they did was they took out the tooth and they've actually made it not bleed as well. So with hypnosis, using hypnosis to do this. Now, I've not done that yet, but or may not ever do that because yeah I'm quite happy with the, the traditional way but um, but in this case the, the case that I'm going to have to deal with um, it's worth me actually doing all this stuff to myself and letting you know how I get on and see what the results are so that's something that, again if you're interested in that I'll be posting that up um, doing a video of um, especially from day one because I'm going to be struggling day one I'm probably going to be in a lot of pain but it's again from day to day I'm going to show you what I do and obviously I'm going to have a challenge in uh, when it comes to physical training so I'm actually going to sh just near enough give you an update of what I've been doing daily um, to make sure that um, you guys see what, what if you have a challenge such as this then there's things that you can do to get around it and um, there's techniques you can do and there's people that can help you and especially what I did, I think this will be something that will, as I said, help people who, uh, recover from uh, an injury. So that is just something that I thought I'd put out there as well. And it's it's happening on July the 30th, um, 2016. So I will update you as soon as I can um, with a video. I think it'll probably be later that evening or um, the day after where I give you the first video and we'll see what state I'm gonna be in. I've never ever had an operation before, so 
I don't know what state I'm going to be in. And they were trying to scare me and say, listen, you need someone to look after you. But <laughs> I'm going to, well, let's see what happens. Um, but yeah, if I call you all on Facebook saying help, then please come and help me. But no, I'm going to, I, should, I hopefully should be okay. And um, yeah, we'll, we'll see how it goes. And I'll use all the resources I can and I'll give you an update um, of how I get on. So, see you soon. Bye.